So we just got to Myrtle Beach and I just wanted to come on here and give you all just a quick little room tour before my kids destroy it. No, I'm kidding. But, you know, before we start putting our stuff everywhere and taking stuff out of suitcases, um, I just want to come over here, come on here and show y'all the room really quick. All right. So when you first come in, you come in this door. And you come down the hallway. This is super cute. How they have the black and white artwork hanging. And then the first room you come to is the kids bedroom. So they have two queen beds in here. And it is connected to the rest room. And then they have a closet that they already put you know, there's stuff in. They have their own TV in here, a phone, a clock, you know, all the accessories, all the good, good stuff. Mm. Moving along is the guest bathroom, which is gonna be the kids' bathroom on this trip. They have shove tower <laughs> uh they have a tub shower combination in here cute little mirror with the lighting fancy all right so moving out of the bathroom have a washer and dryer right here in the hallway closet then you come to the kitchen with the full size appliances. Super cute. Dishwasher. I probably won't cook anything in here, but it's nice to have. Then you have the little dining area with the table. Cute little chandelier. living room area the kids are in here watching tv say hey uh say hey <laughs> and you so cute little living room space it is really spacious i was really surprised when i got here i wasn't expecting the room to be this big um and then out there is the balcony but i'll show that Probably in the morning when it's better lighting. <music> Moving on to the master bedroom. We got Bay in here. Say hey, Bay. It's his birthday. It's Bay's birthday. So. This is a big room. So we are staying at the Hilton Grand Vacation Club, Anderson Ocean Club in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. And y'all, this hotel is super nice. 
um this room is huge i was not expecting this room to be this huge whenever i got here but it's awesome so yeah we're gonna enjoy ourselves we're gonna wind down tonight and then i'll come on here whenever i look cute that's why i'm not facing the camera toward myself because <laughs> i've been traveling and mm, i i look kind of you know but whatever so i'll talk to y'all tomorrow hey y'all so i just wanted to come on here and give you all a quick update i literally look a mess because i worked all day when i got off i took my dog to the vet the most traumatizing thing that i have had to do since i had him so he's staying at the vet while we are here uh we're here to sunday um but the vet is closed on Sunday, so I can't get him until Monday, and I am heartbroken. So I'm not going to talk about that right now. Anyways, don't mind how I look is my whole point. But I just wanted to come on here and give you all a quick little update on what we are planning to do this weekend. So I just sent my husband out to the store, but while he's gone, I just wanted to come on here and let y'all in on a little secret. So... The only reason that we're in Myrtle Beach to begin with is because his birthday is today. So he turned 34, um, but he doesn't know any of the plans that I made for him. So tomorrow we are going horseback riding on the beach. Um, I'm so very excited. We have been horseback riding with this company before um, and it's they were so nice everybody is so nice when i talked to the lady today she was so sweet so i think it's called grand grand strand um horseback riding i'll show you everything tomorrow but we're doing that tomorrow we're going out to eat seafood and his family is coming with us and i think my sister is going to come um and then we're going to top golf possibly after that uh, but we'll see how everything goes. Uh, we'll see what the weather is looking like before we, you know, go out. But I've already booked the horseback riding and everything. So we are definitely doing that tomorrow. And I am super excited because he doesn't know. So I wanted to tell him, like, because the lady called a little while ago and just confirmed everything and I got so excited so I wanted to tell him but he doesn't know <sighs> so hopefully he is super excited and he loves it um I thought I heard him anyways um I'll come back on here in the morning and give you guys an update on everything that's going on but yeah I think I showed y'all the room I gave you all just a quick little room tour um probably to intro this video. I don't know how I did it, but yeah. Talk to y'all later. Bye. what we woke up to a whole bunch of fog <gasps> I can't even see the ocean right, yep foggy, foggy. <laughs> yep that's, so this is what we woke up to this morning where is the ocean
And these folks out here like what y'all crazy folks doing out here? Look at you. You a whole snack. You a zaddy. See, man. 18 and a half. Yeah. I have a Hungarian warm blood at home. It's 18. Dude. And I ride regularly. He's 18. I, I 18 hands, got 100, uh, 1,450,000. I got to come out and check you out. Ready to load? I'm going to pick you up on the count three, okay? <laughs> One, two, Five people on that one. <laughs> we do at summer camp. We put four or five kids and they fish it with them in the pond. I didn't think about how little mine is and how little Lane earlier. Yeah. Oh, that's all reliability. Yeah. You look big out there, honey. Hey, that's you all day, man. Holy moly. You got, you got the biggest, baddest thing out here. Yeah, man, he's big, but that's, that's the Hummer.
Always. <laughs> Always. <laughs> sea urchin party at three. Sea urchin. <laughs> Say hey. Say hey. You, you like crab legs? They good? Hmm? And this one. Yeah. It's a mukbang. <laughs> a mukbang. <laughs> Let me see. I got you. Huh? <laughs> you so cute. You gonna, you gonna be Oh, that's so rude. All right, so we're at Broadway at the beach. <laughs> and about to find something to get into, I guess. Chantel about to take us where the good drinks at. Now let me see. <laughs> cut, 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 <laughs> cut that out. <laughs> I ain't really talking to my camera all day just because we have been extra stupid busy. Horseback rider. We ate. The food wasn't that good for the price. It was ridiculous. It was ridiculous. <laughs> ridiculous and nasty. It's fine. It's all good. Well, none of it good. I mean, the food won't good, but it's all good. get on none of them rides we not we're not Like 
Stop. Look at them two alcoholics. Two alcoholics walking. Where's mine? Guess where he is. You don't get that in this cold? Huh? It's good. Hold up. I said, you don't turn that on. Why? Because y'all don't want nobody to see y'all devil man? <laughs> y'all don't want the world to see the devil man. I can't see it. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Hey, get that. 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 <laughs> She's talking about um, <laughs> I copied you. Can you say you call a cab outside? Mommy, call a cab. Oh. Mm. Uh, you went, you got a Left her by herself. Now she gonna be walking, bow leg and cross eyes. She holding up. Mama, did you eat so much camera? Yeah. She's gonna try it anyway. I might do a TikTok dance. Let's do one of the It's the easiest one to learn. Just follow me. It's the easiest one to learn. I'm bad. Hey. Come on. Oh. They left us. Oh my keys. Hi, hey, Ali. Babe, <laughs> I don't need to drive. I don't think you need to drive me nowhere. They ain't getting on no different trash tonight. We're going to the room. Take it back in. This is cool. Right? You have fun? Wait, you want to take a picture? Yeah, I'm going to take a picture. Yeah, I can take a picture. I mean, over. That's why I shouldn't have told him. We definitely not walking on the, the walkway.
Yep. Hey y'all, so just coming on here just to give y'all an update on what we did today. Today was so fun, I think. Right, babe? Yeah. So, we took babe horseback riding. Even though we tried to surprise him, he's so nosy. So he ended up guessing where we were going before we got there. He said that he had already researched it before. So when I told him the name of the park that we were meeting uh, the lady at, um, he said he already knew, so whatever. He still enjoyed it. The kids really enjoyed it. It was their first time actually horseback riding. Um, well, the two smaller ones, my son said he had done it before. But it was, it was fun. We had a good time. So after we went horseback riding, we went and ate uh, seafood at the original Benjamin. I suggest that everybody stay away from there because first of all, they raised the price up. So for five of us, two adults and three kids, we ended up paying 227, which was ridiculous and the food was cold my husband said he didn't have a hot plate the whole time he was there so it was really disappointing but we when we left there we ended up going to we were gonna go see the christmas lights um and walk through the little christmas light show but oh my god that line was ridiculous when we passed it was all the way down the street and then inside the gate it was still long so we just rode on past there and went to right away at the beach and um we went by wet willies and got some drinks and just walked around sightseeing letting the kids uh walk off some of that energy so now we're back tomorrow we leave unfortunately but i think it was fun the trip was fun so far babe had a good time for his birthday and yeah, I think I did real good. I kept giving myself, pat myself on the back all weekend because I did, I did really good. So, anyways, so we're just about to sit back and watch TV and just chill for the rest of the night. We might finish off the bottle of wine that we had, but other than that, I will probably just talk to y'all in the morning before we leave. Well, it's the end of our journey here at Myrtle Beach. We're packing up to leave. I'm sad. I woke up this morning and I told my husband, like, what? Why do I gotta go back? Because first of all, I need to go get my dog. I miss him. Let's go out on the balcony. It's pretty big. It is a, um... A two bedroom room, a two bedroom condo, I guess. So it comes with this huge balcony. Four chairs and two tables, the entrance from the living room, and the entrance from the master bedroom. So pretty and peaceful. Well, back to North Carolina we go. Until next time.